Hello guys, it's me Z from Wireless Solution and today we are going to work on uh, LG Aristo 3 How to Google verification bypass the Android version 8.1.0 the latest version <coughs> It's new LG Aristo 2 so what we can do you should Go forward first of all wait for the Wi-Fi make sure you are connected to the Wi-Fi so Okay, now once we are connected to the Wi-Fi It will go forward Checking the update it may take a little time Now after this I'll show you that uh, this phone is being hard factor reset with the Google account You can say that this device was reset to continue sign it with the same so in case if you forget it you need to go back make sure it's connected to the Wi-Fi go to the accessibility go to setting vision turn on talk back turn on <coughs> make an L shape talk back, on. Talk back setting double tap it talk back setting. Eight once you come here volume up and down Put both at the same time now you will hit use shortcut use press and hold at the same time again now talk back is off you will come here help and feedback <coughs> get to start voice access now you will come here click on the screen you can see this um, clock sign click on that one it will take you to the Chrome <clears throat> accept and continue no thanks so here we are going to uh, download an a uh, software bit dot l y forward slash uh, l g b a c k back up <coughs> Okay, you will download this one. Continue. Allow. Download. So you can see it's saying that it's been completed. Uh, to confirm, you will go here. You can see it's been completed. Now, what we are going to do, you will click here, type Google. Dot com. click here type anything like Walmart go to map okay turn on <coughs> go to map so once we are in the map skip okay it will take to it to our location okay you will get this direction sign click on this one One sec. You click on this one. Open Google. Okay, you will hit get started. 
once you come here so then you hit this one and say open google <coughs> not sure how to help with and they open google open google opening google okay so you will click this one it had no thanks now the google is open <coughs> so we are here what we are going to do you will type file f i l e file go to file manager allow now you will click here on download <coughs> so what i do before then this make sure you have an empty sd card uh, the memory card you put in your phone okay so now we already have an SD card and this download in the phone memory so you will click this one move hit on this one give me once okay now we are here so you will cl move click on the move sign move to the SD card and hit ok so you can see this come to the SD card <coughs> now what we are going to do you will go back okay once you go back you will type lg switch lg mobile switch click on this one agree you can see the sd card and you will hit restore <coughs> once you hit restore it will be restoring everything so what you are going to do you remove the personalized data the lg app the setting but this download app once you click on this one you can see this is quick shortcut maker you just need to hit next and restore it will take a few moments while restoring the lg backup in the meanwhile guys um those who didn't subscribe the channel please subscribe the channel those who and you can see restart the phone and so hit restart the phone uh, so those guys who did who are new to the channel please subscribe my channel for more informative videos and uh, like the video and share it with your friends your family maybe you don't need it but somebody uh, else will need it and thank you so much for your comments i tried my best to always try my best to like reply to you guys in the comments box but sometime i don't have time uh, but i and uh, i'm always trying my best so right now the phone is going to be restarting so there is next few steps that i'm going to show you how to completely bypass it by the way this similar way you can do it with the uh, uh, lg stylo 4 uh, any new lg devices that has uh, an android version 8.1.0 so you can use the same method for that one okay now we are here so you press the volume up and down at the same time okay the talk back is turned on so make an l shape talk back, talk back. you talk will do back the same tutorial. step that we did before now we are here press and hold it talk together so the talk, talk back, back suspended you will go down help and feedback get voice access make sure you are connected to wi-fi in this case too um, click on the main screen once you click it it will pop up the clock sign click on that one <coughs> once we are here the same way click here type google.com here you will click walmart the same click on the map will take a few second to turn on the map while 
it will take you to like different things of Walmart now you can see you can hit the direction and get started once you hit uh, get started so it's again will open you that same thing here the mic click on that one open Google So now we are done with this we will go to the same um, place now here just remove this one click on here and this time you are going to Q U I C K quick okay so you will type here q u quick shortcut maker um, so here you can see the quick shortcut maker click on this one <coughs> let it be stabilize everything for a couple of seconds then you need to go down once we go down so there you will find an option for a what it's saying setup wizard so once you click on setup wizard you will one two three you will click on the third one and try this one once you this one you can see everything is being restored um, leave the phone like this for a few couple of seconds now the phone is going to restart it restore itself it will turn off and then turn it back on everything will be done so then we, we are going to start from there again can see the phone is being restarted itself now it will erase everything and once we we are going to skip each and every step and then we are going to take it ourselves to the main screen once we get there so after that uh, we just need to hard factory reset the phone uh, once again once we go to the main screen and that will be all uh, you can see that the Google verification account will be already bypassed It will take a few seconds so I'll pass the video in the meanwhile okay guys so the phone is being <coughs> restarted now now what we are going to do hit next skip everything that is coming we are going to skip it continue next next not now skip it anyways he these you we are going to turn it off now accept I agree done slider now what we are going to do you go here go to general no not here R reset and reset factory data reset reset the phone delete all reset and once it's reset you will just start as a new phone and everything will be done thank you so much guys have a nice one enjoy your time we'll be back in the new samsung j2